Okay, here we go, here we go. So, we made it to the town of Onrak, and I need money. So, I'm gonna go to this next area here that we really aren't supposed to go to yet, but I'm gonna go there anyways. Because I feel it. Oh, I hate these things. Here, you just do that. And we'll hit them up. Most everything in the water out here is weak to, uh, lightning, so just blast it all. And everything out here does hit very hard. Thankfully, this... Well, the Ochus aren't really weak to anything. Most everything else is. But the Ocho can... Po poison. It's an Ocho. Not an Ochu. The Ochus are the red ones. Which we can run into up here. And they are pretty nasty. Put you there. So yeah, there's a little hidden cave up here I'm gonna go to. It's got some nice stuff in it, but I mainly just need money. So I figured, you know, why not? Let's just go ahead and run up here. Go ahead and get this out of the way. That way I don't have to do it later. Didn't plan on it, but ran out of money. Buying essential equipment. There's the Ochu, but they call it a Nacho or something in here. In this game. I don't know. They are pretty tough. Ow. Yeah, they'll they'll murder you. I don't think they can poison you though. I'm I, I'm not sure, don't hold me to it, but And I get the last one. Alright, keep moving. Go to the waterfall cave. Woo! Alright. Trick to this place, keep anytime you can go left, go left. And then on the way back, anytime you can go right and down, do that. Yeah, this should be too bad. Let's do it like that. Yeah, that heal staff is going to save my butt for the rest of the game. Ow. Alright, kill it, please. Thank you. Oh, jeez. He keeps listening. Hey, he's fighting. Good. Free healing. Yeah, that black belt's getting nasty now. Yeah, go up and left until you hit a wall. And then go down. Oh, nose. Wait a minute. I want to make sure I get rid of these stupid things. There we go. This battle's over. Ooh, I'm gonna get so much experience off this fight. Those wizard mummies are just, they're ridiculous. They can hit you so hard. Look at that, almost a thousand experience off that fight. So yeah, the next the next couple goals here is I'm gonna finish up this place, uh, get all the items out of here. There's only one real treasure box anyways. And then we're gonna go to the town of Onrag and get the Oh, this ain't gonna be good. And get uh, go to the water shrine. So, well, before we do that, though, I gotta go and buy something, which is why I need the money. Oof! Yeah, these guys are so hard, but I can hit them just as hard back. Shisha! What are you left now? Oof! That was not cool game. Alright, we're almost done here. 
Yeah, we get some nice stuff down here, though. Yeah, these guys are so resistant to magic, I might as well just have him fight and do the same thing. <laughs> Oh, good. We're striking first. Free healing. Yeah, hit him with that. Yeah, I think these can also uh, turn you to stone. I'm not sure, but they're they're not too tough. stuff to go off is a good time. But there is one item I'm getting down here that's very, very, very important. Even more important than this other weapon I'm getting. That's right, a mandatory fight full of douchebaggery. So we're doing an all-out offensive. Don't you do it, don't you freaking do it, don't you do it. Alright, good, we got that off. Just kill the birds. Thank you. Now, lightning two go off. Finish it up. Yeah, those wizard bumps hit pretty hard. Wow. Another round. Maybe I get some healing out of it. Yep. Yeah, the best thing to think of when you're doing this part of the game is you're going to get used to hearing that healing staff go off all the time. Dang it, I'm going to fight that fight. Let me back out and think too. Wizard staff. The ribbon. I'm definitely equipping I want that on you. Is it the same armor as a cap? Go ahead and equip that for right now. Uh, but it protects you against all status ailments like stone and poison and sleep and just everything. It's freaking awesome. And then we get the cube from him, which we'll need later. Money! More money! Even more money! And we get the defense sword. Doesn't show it, but that's what it is. And I want that on him. I want to put the wizard staff. Let's give it to him. Yeah. No, actually, he's my. This is my status helmet guy. I want it on the red mage. Okay. I wonder if I can use this. No, oh, I can't. All right. See, warp works. It just teleports you up one floor, which since that was the only floor left. <laughs> I'm like, okay. You know what? You use that wizard staff. That uses confuse on all the enemies. Which can be very handy in certain battles. Get that big orange blade now. Good. He's confused. He's confused. Didn't work. He's confused. So I got almost all of them confused. And it doesn't wear off until it says they wear off. So there's no physical attack that'll do that stuff. So it kind of, that can also help protect your party. So you can use like the wizard staff to confuse all the enemies and then heal up with the, the healing staff. So a pretty good little combination you can do like that. And so you don't sit there and just beat themselves up, but they don't do any kind of damage to themselves. Which is stupid. I don't know why they did it like that. It's like I get hit and I get like 40,000 hit points taken away. They hit themselves with just 8 damage. <laughs> oh, no! Oh, no. Okay, this isn't so bad. And I'm going to say that and I'm probably going to die and watch. But no, there's these, like I said, the Berettas out here are just nasty. Nasty monsters. I 
should have used the wizard staff on this fight. Oh well, I used it out easily. They poison! This one does a wyvern for poison things. That's why I like, like to just stay in the river in this area as much as I can. Now I gotta leave the river. And I don't wanna leave. Actually, you know what? There's a way to cheat this. I'm gonna do that. Because I don't wanna fight Beretta's. They'll kill me. They're an overpowered bullcrap monster. Ah, just use my stat. Alright. This makes battles a lot more interesting. Good lord, game. Are you just gonna poison my whole party? Good, they're all confused. Eat it. Alright, good. A little free healing. Never hurts. Jeez, what hit my friggin'? Ow, well, I guess that critical hit must have hit my black mage. Jeez. More time wasting. And this is when it gets really annoying. I'm gonna rearrange the entire party. Ah! -ha! Okay. Let's cheat. Actually, the land right up here on this patch of desert. I think it's right here. Yeah. This is a shop. I sell one thing, a bottle. Ooh, I got just enough money, too. <laughs> okay, so now we need to take that stupid thing. Over here. The town of Gaia. Which we didn't show off earlier. Now we can. That's the only reason why you ever have to go to this town. But they do sell those protect ranges, which, which are nice. And while I'm here, I'll sell off some stuff things that I don't need anymore. How close am I to level up anyways? Might as well check. Oh, very close. item in the game. Alright, let's get rid of this ice sword and this flame sword because I don't need them anymore. And now look, I have money again. Now the defense sword, if you use it as an item in battle, it'll cast ruse on whoever's holding it, which is a pretty nice little defense spell, and it increases your evasion by like 40, which is ridiculous, and it does work, as evasion is not bugged in this game. <laughs> you can literally, if there's an uh, enemy or a boss that like, uses primarily physical attacks, like the next one that's coming up, you can just spam spells like Ruse and Invisible 2, and just obliterate the boss so they won't even be able to touch you. Bottle. Hey, we got a fairy. Get me out of there. And we have the Oxy Ale. And I'll tell you what, next time I'm going to meet you back at Onrak, that way we can just go straight into the dungeon and save a little time. Because that's exactly what I'm doing. I'm going straight back. So I'll catch you guys later.